What's up, Internet? It's time for the very first unboxing of the DC Legion of Collectors box. Um, I'm very excited for this. I can't wait to open this box up. As you can see behind me, I'll turn the camera off for one second. I got the awesome uh, a, kind of a combination of Batman and Superman. Um, this is not the uh, background I will use every time, of course, for the Legion of Unboxing. I'm still looking for a very cool DC lo uh, image that can uh, show off you know all the DC characters as many as possible uh, so, uh, similar to how I am with the, the Marvel uh, unboxing so let's get into this bad boy and see what's going on with this very first box from Legion of Collectors I'm just gonna put it sideways here the uh, art design is pretty cool on the very first or for the comics it's kinda hard to see with the uh, blue alright as you know, if you get the uh, Marvel uh, boxing or if you ever seen the other Marvel boxings, you know they always come with a badge and a pin. If I can get these two off, I would show it to you. All right, the very first bad, uh, badge is a Wonder Woman badge with Legion of Collectors on the bottom. And the pin is a very cool one. There we go. And it has Superman. Let's see if I can get that on the image. There we go, kind of. But it has Superman across it. Um, it has Legion of Collectors at the bottom and his uh, DS logo. Or the uh, the, the Crest of kal -El. Not the really S logo, but um, on the bottom. Alright, for the very first item is the shirt. Um, I believe it's similar to the very first Marvel shirt. Uh, where it showed uh, Ultron versus you know one of the other characters. So let's open this up and read to, uh, to make sure. Yep, it's very similar to the uh, the very first unboxing. Uh, if you have the uh, Marvel shirt, it's very similar to the very first one there. I'm not really a fan of the light. Uh, light blue, but I you know I prefer dark colors for shirts, but I'll I'll work with it. All right, the very first the next item is gonna be the pop vinyl. Come on. Um, if you've seen the Twitter or anything that has Legion of Collectors, you know all about this one already. It is the armored Batman, exclusive to the uh, pop vinyl or to, exclusive to the box. Um, so. If you were wanting that, then you would have to order this box in order to get it. Um, it's very... The picture of it, they show pictures of it, but it looks even better in person. I guess, you know, pictures don't really do something justice most of the time, but but that's the uh, pop vinyl for that one. Alright, the next item we have... Oh, wow, this is very interesting. We have two dorbs here. Uh, if you didn't know about Funko, they had the dorbs collection. Um, you can't really see them because they're actually kind of green so that's kind of a downfall about showing you but um, it's basically Aquaman on one side Superman on the other um, if you ever go to Hot Topic you see the uh, the Aquaman on this side it's, it's that glow in the dark style figure where it's the, the very uh, aquamarine green you know being Aquaman aquamarine uh, Superman is mostly green so that's pretty cool it's kind of I hate that it kind of the the green screen on the back you know behind me is uh, causing it to uh, fade out. But this is very cool. I love the uh, double design uh, design of this. So um, I probably will post a picture of this on my Twitter down below if you want li to uh, link it so you can see what it looks like without the green screen affecting it. And next we have, and this is the final item. We have Batman. Superman comic. Let's see if I can get the box out of the way so I can show it in full. This is what the comic looks like. Pretty good. I'm not really the type. I don't really like taking these out of the uh, wrapping, so I never actually get to read them. But um, I do enjoy collecting them. Um, so that's it for the very first DC unboxing for the uh, Legion of Collectors. Uh, let me know what you think. I thought it was pretty good. I mean, I'm a fan of DC. Uh, I'm, I'm more of a fan of Marvel, really. But um, 
Uh, one thing I'm really excited for is uh, the May version of this box. It's DC, ver uh, it's DC TV, which means you're going to have things from the shows of Flash, Arrow, um, probably Legends of Tomorrow, and probably, who knows, even Supergirl. So if you're a fan of those TV shows, you definitely want to check out uh, the May box. Um, look into getting into it. Um, who knows what it's going to be. Uh, I'm sure there's going to be a pop vinyl or two involved and maybe some of the Doors version of the uh, characters from the Flash comics. Who knows, there may be even be some new characters thrown into the mix with Cisco and Dr. Snow as pop vinyls. Who knows. But um, let me go ahead and close this real quick. Um, I'm, I'm happy with this first box. I wish the t-shirt the was a little bit better, but you know that's ma mainly because I don't like the color of the shirt. Because uh, I don't like the light blues or light colors like that. But um, just let me know what you think of the, the box. Let me go get there. Um, I know I'm, I'm happy with the first box. Some people may be kind of disappointed because it's only you know three, four items total with the comic, the pot doors, and the vinyl. Uh, but you know I enjoy it. Um, I can't wait to see what the future uh, holds for this uh this box, and I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thank you for watching, and just like I said, I'll sh post a picture on my Twitter with the uh, what the doors look like, not being affected by the green screen. And uh, thank you for watching. Comment and like below if you do. And uh, have a good uh, month and day. And I will see you back in May for the DC box. And unless you watch other um, other boxes of mine that I do for unboxings. Yeah, that's about it. So I will see you again, Internet.